car ride. So now it's called the Presa Overlook Canyon Trail. And wow, they weren't kidding. This is scenic. Man, it's cool. You just you don't see this in Lubbock. You just don't. Now, like I said, we got it. We got our own beautiful canyon. We got the Yellow House Canyon, and it's it's actually pretty nice, especially when it rains. But we just don't have stuff like this. I mean, that's like I said. It's the great thing about Texas. Every place has something unique. And this is truly, truly magnificent. And I bet it's, like I said, I bet it's even prettier when they're not going through such a drought. See that like green foliage down there? When I came down here in November of 2015, um, it, 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 the canyons and the you know, the areas around it, around the road, they were pretty green, you know. I mean, we're not, I'm not talking like forest green, but they were pretty green. So now, see, like so you can see up there, it's not much green, and it's kind of dried out compared to what I saw before. So, but nevertheless, even with it as dry as it is, it's, this is still really, really pretty. simply fantastic here I'm gonna get a quite a good shot this is I mean this is this was shocking to me I didn't, I didn't think it was gonna be this nice it's definitely worth the hike it, it really is and I bet down when you get to the Lake Amistad Reservoir in Rio Grande I bet it's even nicer or if it's not nicer, it's different. So it's definitely, I'm definitely going to have to come back here and, you know, hike this trail again. This is, this is, this is really cool. I, I, I must say.